Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with part 3 in my palette of the month for July and I'm using the Moonspell palette by Lunar Beauty My friend Julia picked this for me, I asked her to pick a palette for my palette of the month She picked this, so so happy So if you didn't know The palette looks like this and I have done two looks I did a purple look and like a green halo purple thing and today I'm actually thinking about taking this middle row I don't think I'm going to use all of the shades in it but I'm going to use some of them and I have always like the middle row is the neutral row <laughs> but when I swatched it all like the shades I was like maybe not that neutral <laughs> so I am just going to prime my eyes and then we get started and I don't know how this will go maybe it turns out to like a neutral look I have no idea <laughs> we will just have to wait and see okay so I think for this look the hardest thing for me is I don't know where to start I think I want to take Samantha on like my whole lid but I have no idea what I want to do in my crease because Samantha it is a little bit like pinkish and first I was thinking to take Winifred and Kiki but this Winifred is pretty like warm and Kiki is not but maybe I should just do it have I ever cared about doing warm and cold? no so I will start with Winifred and take it on a big fluffy brush and swoop it in my crease I can't remember if I've tried this shade and I think I said this in my last part with this palette part number two that I am so happy to do looks with this I always want to try to find ways to use palette that I have in my collection that I don't use that much because I know that not everybody is able to buy all the makeup they want and somebody just maybe don't want to buy that much makeup so I think it's fun to do things with things I already have so I really like this shade actually then I'm going in with Kiki this one and this <laughs> all the shades in this palette are inspired by witches and Kiki is from what is it even called in English I think when I did my first impression on this I asked myself the same But I really, really love that movie. I love Miyazaki's movies. Princess Mononoke. Princess Mononoke. How do you say? Princess Mononoke. Princess Mononoke. Mononoke. I, I, that is my favorite, I think. And then maybe Kiki. Actually, even though it may seem like that on my channel, I sometimes like to do more neutral looks. I think it's fun to do like crazy colorful but sometimes I just want to do something a little bit more neutral maybe this won't turn out neutral I don't know so maybe it's a little bit early for me to say that I I really like this crease now I'm going in with Samantha this one and I think I will take it on my whole lid and this seems like a really fun shade when I've swatched it. So we will see how it looks on my eye. Maybe not as fun. I don't know if it gets like the whole dimension of it. It feels like it has a little bit of gold in it actually. Okay, I I don't know. Just don't listen to me. Oh, 
Okay, even though this is maybe super like a neutral look, I really like it. Sorry for all that of you that wanted to see something crazy colorful. But at the same time, I want my... I almost said free looks one palette. I want my palette of the month to really like discover the palettes and show you all the different things you can do with it. And I think when it is like five not that colorful shadows in a palette, so a third of the palette is a little bit more toned down, I think. I just want to use them and show you what you can do. Especially maybe if you aren't like me and buying a lot of palettes and just want to buy maybe one or two palettes. This might be a good thing that you can do with like an everyday look, more neutral look if you want that as an everyday and you can do crazy colorful. I hope I make sense. I think I actually do for once. I think though I want to deepen down and I think I want to try to deep down with Mary this other shimmer in this row but I don't know how this there are some different formulas on the shimmers in this I think as bad as I am with undertones as bad as I am with the shimmers oh no <laughs> with formulas Okay, this really worked. I hope you can see a difference. I can at least. Okay, I actually think that I am happy with the lids like this. It feels like it was a long time since I did something that wasn't that colorful. So, I'm going to take away the fallouts, fix my base and take a little bit more of color in my brows. These are like my work brows, not my makeup brows. So I'm going to fix that and then I come back and we do the lower lash. I think I'm gonna put in something a little bit different in my inner corners, we will see. For my under eyes, I think I want to go in with Kiki and uh, Mary. Uh, like out here. So I'm going to start with Kiki and take it on my whole lower lash. And then I'm going in with Mary, the dark shimmer I had out here and try to, I hope this doesn't fall on my face, and just like take it a little bit down here. It worked. Whew. So, like that. And I'm thinking for my inner corner to actually go in with Hermione. It is a little bit lighter than it looks, or like a little bit, a little bit more like a topper, maybe. So, I'm going to put this in my inner corner and I'm going to take it just on a brush and not spraying it. I hope it work and then a little bit up here I don't know if this was a good idea but I've done it and cat hair in my nose so I am really happy with this actually i think the shadow i have on the most of my lid samantha is a really really nice shade and i really liked how this mary looked on top of it so i will take something in my waterline put on mascara try to choose a lippy and then i am coming back with the finished third look and this is the finished look for my waterline i used get paid from Colourpop and on my lips I used Unspoken from Nabla because I wanted a really dark red lip. So this is my more neutral look maybe we should say with the moon spell. I used Winifred, Mary, Samantha, Kiki and Hermione. So I think the only shade I haven't used in this palette in these videos are Marnie and Sarah. And I 
like this look i understand if not all of you <laughs> that watches me like this but i really do sometimes i just want to do something a little bit more toned down and this is something that i would happily wear like going out and eat or something i usually i am okay with going out with crazy colorful makeup but when i'm going out to eat i usually don't want that because i live in a kind of small town and people stare and i'm not having it so yeah i am happy with this look i hope you like this video and i actually thinking about doing the last video with this palette next week i am thinking about doing a palette bingo and do like take revenge of the palette bingo with this one I did a palette bingo with all the rules on this one and it turned out I was so annoyed, I was so mad, I just hated it, every part of it. So I am thinking about doing like a revenge and maybe not do a palette bingo with all the rules because we might end up with the same shit. So yeah, I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do and don't forget to check out the other two videos I have done with the moon spell in this palette of the month. It has been so fun to play with this and next week it's coming both a look, my palette bingo and also my review on this. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!